Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying four flavors of fruit spreads from the Bon Mon Mon Advent Calendar. Josh sent me this uh, for 2019, and so we have, uh, what, 20, 21, or 21, 22, 23, and 24, yeah. The last four that were in here, not in that order, but this is just how, the order that I put them in. Uh, so we have seedless raspberry, raspberry lychee, raspberry red currant and purple fig cinnamon so now you get to open those <laughs> we are trying they're actually pretty easy to open they are we're i haven't even tried honestly uh we're trying each one of them uh with toast because we feel like you can really uh taste the flavor of them in toast or on toast uh, these are uh one ounce 28 gram little pots and uh they're 70 calories each for the for the fruit spread. So this is seedless raspberry. Now I have bought uh, their raspberry um, many times and I love it. So So this is not an exclusive flavor. This is something. Well, the kind that I get has seeds. Oh. Okay. Yeah, and this is seedless. So I would it's gonna taste the same, I'm sure. Wow. Well. Very strong flavor. I love that. Mm. Yes, normally um, I buy it at Walmart, and I'm thinking they only sell the kind with the seeds, but I don't know why that would be the, why wouldn't they have seedless all the time? I don't know. I like the seedless though, because I don't really like the seeds. But these are supposed to be limited um, edition flavors to this advent calendar, and every one of them have been. So, this, I don't think this is out normally because every time I bought the raspberry, it does have seeds. But I can tell you, um, we had their, uh, their <laughs> straw, was it the strawberry? What was it that had seeds? Something we had. Blackberry. Had, okay. It was blackberry and they were huge. They and were big and hard. Okay, the raspberry's not like that. The raspberry, you do notice them. You do notice them in there, but they aren't bigger that big and they aren't as hard it's so good. they don't bother you yeah, because if they because i told you i would never buy a whole jar of that just right, because of those like seeds. seeds so for me to buy several of these right. that just shows you it, it does not bother me at all the seeds uh but i love the seedless raspberry i wish they sold that all the time that is excellent this one is the raspberry lychee so let's see this seems, uh, this does have, it looks like some seeds down in there. I think what I love the consistency of pretty much every spread we've had. Yes. It's, they're very um, smooth. They're not, they're not jelly by any means and they're, they're not as, quite as dense as preserves. They're more, they're more spreadable than all those. I don't yeah. love those seeds. This does have some seeds. You didn't get as many because you got off the top. No, but you get them, but they're not uh, hard. They're, they're, you can feel the texture of them, but they're not, they crunch through pretty easily. I really, really like that mm -hmm. one. That is really good. Um, that is, it's not, um, because it has the lychee in with it, it's not as strong. The, just the, the pure raspberry is a very strong, yeah, powerful very, very raspberry. <laughs> you need to like raspberry. So the raspberry, if you make baked wool tarts, this would be the perfect center for your cookies right. or baked wool tarts. Um, this is, is lighter, but I absolutely love it. I like it. it too. Love it. Yeah. Okay. So now, now we have the raspberry red currant. And this, it, a soft. it yes, this has some liquid. Some have been a little runnier than others, but they're still not. Um, it's not too bad. This is is full of seeds. Yeah, raspberry red currant. I can feel the seeds like crunching. <laughs> That's the raspberry. That's yeah. what the raspberry is like. So. So you can feel the seeds. They're not bad though. You can feel them, but they're not as bad as that. They're not hard. No, the, they're not hard. The, the other blackberries were like hard seeds. And, and I don't feel like they're as big. Yeah, they're not. 
But these actually crunched really easily, whereas the other one was kind of hard. You really felt the crunch, mm -hmm. like you were chewing on something you shouldn't be. Right, yeah. <laughs> these aren't bad. These are these just add a little bit of texture. Yes, they do. Um, I like I like that. I like one the too. flavor. It's it's a lighter flavor, but it's it yes, it's light. You don't get as much of the raspberry, of course, as you do with the pure raspberry, but it's still uh, very nice. Mm. I don't know that I would know red currant. No, um, maybe that adds a little tartness. But it was too, very so good. No, 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 now no. this one, the, all these have been raspberry, and then we have this oddball, purple fig cinnamon. Oh, the figs though. But we love fig, and we like cinnamon. So. Oh, it's not pure cinnamon powder. Yeah, it just depends on. Did I give you enough? It looks very runny. This one is runnier. Yeah. It's thicker down in there. So if you have a full jar, you might want to stir it a little bit. Right. Get big, don't you? Mm -hmm. You know, that reminds me a lot of apple butter. Mm -hmm. I mean, a lot like apple butter. The texture is similar. That is even, delicious. Even the flavors are, are very similar. That's probably one of my favorite ones out of this box. Yeah, I can see why. Yeah, that is, I love it's, that. It's very sweet. The cinnamon, honestly, the cinnamon to me is light. You no, but like, you would really miss it if it wasn't. Yeah, oh, yeah. But it, yes. But you're tasting more fig than you are cinnamon. Yes. Yeah, but the cinnamon really adds, it heightens that flavor. It does. It, it sure does. Yeah, that's it. probably one of my favorite ones. Well, it's funny because I think I've saved the best for last. Yeah, because I've liked most of these. Uh, I, I like all I wouldn't these. have a whole bo uh, jar, I wouldn't have a whole jar of the red currant. The red currant. And I personally probably wouldn't have just the raspberry one because it's really, really strong. It is extremely strong, but see, I like that. Um, but the other two, I would definitely get the job. Okay, of. so raspberry red currant, I liked it, but, and I probably would have a whole jar if these other ones weren't available. See, for me, if I know I like something, if I know I have a favorite, then why wouldn't I buy that all the time? No. Why am I going to buy something that's not my favorite when I can buy my favorite? That just, you know, <coughs> that's just one of those things. So, out of this whole advent calendar, our top five, would you agree these would be? Because I have two on the box. Yeah, these are probably some of my favorites, yeah. Okay. Yeah, because so, I really do like the raspberry because it didn't have the seeds. I really did like it. Um, but you said it was too strong for you. It's, you said it's you... It's very, very strong raspberry. Okay, so Kevin went and buy... So, these are my top five, and then Kevin's top four. <laughs> well, no, you have an extra one that I don't have. Yeah, kind of. Okay, so my top five. Um, I would say my very, very favorite out of the whole calendar would be the um, seedless raspberry, which Kevin... Oh, really? Yeah, Kevin Lee. She loves choose. raspberry. I so. love raspberry. And then I would choose the raspberry lychee. And then I would choose the uh, pineapple and passion fruit. That would be my number three. My number four would be the purple fig cinnamon, and my number five would be the strawberry and wild strawberry. So, Kevin has the same four out of five, but you would replace the raspberry with quince, probably. Probably, yeah. yeah Kevin, Except mine would be a complete in order, because I would probably put the fig one first. Yeah, go ahead, give them an order. And then the pineapple one second. The pineapple uh, passion fruit. I love second. that one. That it was really, really good. It was absolutely delicious. And then the strawberry. Then and the wild strawberry. And then yeah. the. Um, then you've got these and the quince. The quince probably next, and then then this one with the raspberry. If I had to give a top six, then the quince would be my sixth one. Yeah, it, it, it was be, good. It was it a very light flavor, six. but it was good. And but then, yeah, I would get this big one all the time. It's really good. It's very yes. So. Um, I saved the best for the yeah, last review. That's what I did. <laughs> so, um, but I've said it in every video. I'm going to say it again. This is an awesome, awesome gift. Um, if you didn't see, I did a video of opening every single day. Um, it it, uh, it had, <clears throat> there are little doors with numbers. Yeah, little cardboard. And I took them off. You yeah. don't have to, but um, I love the look at it uh, of it once it was finished and it was all full of the little jars. Uh, really, really cute. You and, know, and you could give this gift 
for Christmas. It would normally give an advent calendar before Christmas. You to open it up down. to. Right. And, and you could do that. But you could also just give it to them as a Christmas present. They could open them Absolutely. every day of January. If yeah. To. Yeah. This, uh, yeah. This would be uh, perfect for anybody. So, uh, grandma and grandpa or just uh, a co-worker. Anybody that likes uh, jellies and spreads. That, you know, it's not. It's a little just, expensive for a just, co-worker though. It would be. Um, <laughs> Yeah, I'm thinking Josh uh, at least paid probably $40 for this. So, uh, yes, it is pricey, but I do think it's a great gift. Maybe do the gift exchange or something. Maybe. Yeah, uh, yeah, you have to like the person a lot. <laughs> I know Josh likes me a lot to give me this, um, but they do tell the names of them on the back. They also had the names on the side. I decided not to peek. I was not going to look and see what was on the inside. So every single day was a surprise to me because I had no idea what was coming. I, I just, I wanted to be surprised. So Josh, I appreciate it very, very much. And if I ever see these, our top five flavors on the shelf, I would definitely get them because they were delicious. So uh, thank you. I hope everyone enjoyed these videos and thanks for watching.